All right, guys, as part of this webinar, we really wanted to bring in a remote guest to show NDI Bridge in action. And who better than Roberto Musso coming in from Milan, Italy. Roberto is on the NDI team. I've worked with him for many years. He's a huge expert in video production and live streaming. Roberto, how are you today? Hey, Paul, I'm good. And what about you? I'm doing great. In fact, I am so excited that you were able to join my NDI bridge. Uh, yeah, this, this is, is amazing. This is amazing. I mean, let, it blew my mind. I can't believe how easy this was. Um, I'm really, really excited about this. So Roberto has joined our NDI bridge and he's going to show how easy it is to control PTZ Optics cameras from the other side right. of the world. Roberto, why don't you tell us a little bit about this and, and what you're going to do? So, um, and by the way, I, let me tell you a secret because my internet connection is just an LTE connection. It's not even a fiber. Wow. Uh, because where I live, the internet connection is not good. And so years ago during pandemic, I found this uh, LTE service. So it's just a SIM card with the, with the, an LTE antenna. And I mean, it's working. And so uh, we just tested a few minutes before I go and uh, I have, but let me share my screen is, is probably easier. Okay, share. So can uh, you see my screen? Yeah, so this is the VizRT, um, right. vi what yeah. is it called? Viz Vector. Vector, the Vector Plus. Right. And so I receive your PTZ camera through NDI Bridge, which is already wow. Because again, I, my connection is LTE, is not even a fiber. And uh, so if I open the camera setting, I have some preset. And so I can even remote your camera. Wow. Over an LTE connection. This is mind blowing. The latency is so low. Uh, are you able right. to do pretty intuitive pan tilt zoom controls with with what you're seeing from your side? Yeah. So there is a little bit of latency because of the connection. So I I, I had to enable 200 millisecond of buffer mm. on the receiving side, but I can try to go lower than that. You know, I can decrease the the latency and do some tests. You know, my recommendation to the user is before going in production with B, with bridge try to to manage different setting on the on the buffer uh, so the buffer is working on the receiver side okay and so you just adjust a little bit increase or decrease the buffer setting in bridge so let me show you uh where is my bridge this is bridge and so oh no it's 500 milliseconds let's go down to 200 okay let me see now yeah it's a bit faster right yep wow that looks so nice so let's talk about the bridge for a second here so i'm yep. the host of this bridge i have maybe I have a better internet connection than you roberto i'm not i'm not sure I, it's I it's so. not it's not fiber I will say we don't have fiber here either, but we have a oh. public IP address that we're pulling in yes. from our you know internet service provider. We created a uh, a port that forwards directly to this machine here that I'm using that's hosting the NDI bridge, and I just simply yeah. copy and pasted this information. I sent it over to you, right. and um, you know basically you were able to just plug that in under the join section, and now you've joined exactly. Um, and you have access not just to this camera, but all my cameras. And by the way, I have access to all of your NDI right. uh, sources. Right. And so you can even manage my vector. You can change the input in my vector. I mean, it's bidirectional, and all the metadata are bidirectional. This is this is one of the really important points I wanted to make here right. with our webinar about the SuperJoy is that the SuperJoy is certified for NDI. So if I go to the SuperJoy interface here, one of the things we'll see is that we have the search functionality on 
um, directly on the PTZ Optics SuperJoy, and I can search for all NDI sources on my local area network. And what that means is, is that if I'm connected over to someone with a bridge, their sources will show up and can be controlled. So here's all your sources, Roberto, coming in to the PTZ Optics SuperJoy. So exactly. this, the SuperJoy can easily be used to control cameras from anywhere in the world using NDI Bridge. Um, so you've got a lot of sources here coming in from that VizRT Vector Plus. Um, and if any of you know any PTZ camera, you can pull it into the SuperJoy from anywhere in the world using this NDI search functionality. Exactly. So this is really exciting. We're showing Roberto controlling cameras in our studio all the way from Milan, Italy. I can control his cameras. We can use, I'm using vMix. He's using a VizRT Plus system. Uh, we're using NDI Studio. We can use a PTZ Optic SuperJoy. This is really what NDI is all about. Interconnectability, software, hardware, NDI tools, multiple manufacturers working together to create solutions for video production and live streaming. Right. And again, don't forget that NDI is not only video. I mean, there are metadata like PTZ control, KVM. Uh, there are custom metadata and audio. I've yeah. been doing a test with with a, a company that is developing an interesting audio application, sending over bridge 255 audio channel back and forth. I mean, this is unbelievable. Roberto, why don't you go ahead and show um, the tally light functionality quickly. If you go into your vision <clears throat> oh, mixer yeah. and switch the sources from preview and output. Mike, if right. you show the NDI studio over here in our, the, the, the camera uh, on this uh, NDI studio, Mike, you'll see right. that it's changing from green to red. So green exactly. is, is preview, red is output. And we've actually got two different systems running now. We have this camera is in the output of your vision mixer and then it also is in the output of vmix which we're using in our studio here so to have right. all of that working together so if you're working with a remote producer or remote talent and they can see if they're on live or in preview or an output wherever they are in the world is a really important point well yeah, thank you I mean, so much roberto hey yeah. it's my pleasure you know I, anytime talking with you is always a, a great pleasure I really, really appreciate it for this segment of our our webinar. Thank you so much for tuning in to show this. I really wanted to have someone across the Atlantic Ocean, someone far away, and who could be better than Roberto Musso from NDI to show how great this tool works. Thank you. <laughs>